everybody. Today we are here in Desert Center going to be uh, towing this Peterbilt tractor here. CHP called it. It's been abandoned here for a few days so they called the owner and he said he doesn't have any funds to fix it so therefore he wants it towed and we're gonna take care of it. So this is what happens often with towing companies. We get stuck with junk. But it looks like a good truck. How you doing, sir? So they don't they don't want to fix it. <laughs> All right. Uh, any plates or anything? I, can you get me inside? Like, yeah, I brought a lockout out, kit, so I can get you in. Out where the vent's at yeah. Or... Yeah, I brought a lockout kit, so I should be able to get you in there. All right. So uh, since I knew it was abandoned, I brought a lockout kit with me. See if we can get in here. How long has this been here? We tagged it on the 14th. I guess it's been here longer than that. What's the date today? 19th. Oh, yeah. It's been here. <laughs> yeah. It's crazy. It amazes me. Let's see if we can get into this. Semis are a little tricky sometimes. Yeah, that'd be good. Appreciate it. Do you want to hold that for me? Thank you. I haven't used this thing. Yeah. This is like for old school cars. <laughs> Alrighty, the, oh wow, look at that. Obviously they were having something wrong with it. The bench, usually it's stamped on there, but it's probably right here, here it is. Got a new fixed remote. Oops, wrong one.
grab one more bungee. Good to start hooking? Yeah. All right, cool. All right, light bar's on. Better. Okay. So I think I need a boom down. Not a fan of the deer dan receivers. I like the two hole thing, but to slide them, man, you really put some force on them. Two holes are nice though. to the other side. Pretty dang close. That should do the trick. connection down here. What'd you find out from the bin? Anything? No, 
But uh, they called the owner out of. Um, uh -huh. It's this guy. Uh huh. Tank down here. Check this out. Never seen this before. Custom. Funny, our door, our thing on our white feet does the same thing.
Alright, that's supplying air. Let it fill up. Get our axle tie downs out. Get that. Feels like it's sort of hang up, hung up, but should be good to bring it in. in the middle. This is the way this truck's set up to tie stuff down, so this is how we do it. Can't say I'm a particular fan of how long it takes, but it's pretty secure. We'll give it that.
five more minutes, I should be out of here. Luckily, Peterbilt's pretty easy to pull. I say that, and I'm gonna get karma. Let's see. That is half, which is a pretty good guess for Peterbilt's. Peterbilt's and Camelot's are halves usually. Do you need a bail out of here? Huh? Do you need a bail out of here? Uh, okay, I just I need like you three more minutes and I'll be out of here. Yeah. I just need to throw two more chains. Let me get Appreciate it. Be safe out there. That's why we check. We'll put a little more tilt into it. Like that. Then we'll take up a little bit of slack. Alright, good to 
go. Some towels. Take a quick little walk around, check everything again. Drive lines there.